Greetings and welcome back to Applings to Rimworld, where we are under attack by mechanoids. Uh, they are tired of being passive in this ongoing battle. They have decided to attack because we also had a, a short uh, a fuse blown, so we are still recovering our energy from that. But we're producing more than we're using, so that's the main thing there. Um, work has continued on the prison cells. It's coming along. Now we need to get our snipers into a good position here. Ah, oh, we've got a man-hunting boar outside. Emily, can you go kill it for me? Chop, chop, please. Shoot, shoot, shoot. There we go. That'll do. LMC. Jiggly God. Where are you, Sir Saturn? All of you outside, please. Start shooting right away. Uh, we are going to want Rock Philip over here as well. Hands, Overlord, Armus, Bartok. Honestly, having you down here isn't going to be that useful. Oh my lord, look at the amount of centipedes. They are well equipped as well. They're going to be very dangerous for us. Okay, come on. Fire. Quickly. Oh, so sad. How are you doing? Nose has been shot off. Well, that is just annoying. I have to make a new nose now. You scoundrel, you. There we go. One down. Please kill the other one now. <laughs> I can't believe you got no nose shot off. Of all bloody things to be shot off. Right. Nose, 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 nose. Artificial nose. Aww. That was his favorite nose. There we go. Well done. Now, this is going to be nasty. They've got charge blasters, but you have got an Inferno Cannon. That is something I fear. I fear it quite a lot, actually. Let's get inside. Um, you should definitely go inside. Emily, go. So, Saturn... I'm afraid you're going to be hanging outside for the time being. I want you to get a couple of shots off while they're outside of the range to fight back. But then, I'm going to want you immediately pulling back. Because we don't want to play with that weapon effect. So, Saturn, spread out a little bit. Let's have everyone move around. So that one shot from that Inferno Cannon isn't going to hit everyone. That's right. Come on, you can keep going. We'll notice that they're within uh, attack range because it'll slow down. I think... Right. It's right about there. Okay. Pull back. Pull back now. Move. Well done. Well done. Stay inside. Are they in a position to fire? I think they might be. Oh dear. You are actually... Move, LMC. Oh, that was close. Oh, that is bad. Ha-ha! Take that. Uh, you know what? This is getting a little bit too hot, though. Get back indoors. Well done, Sir Saturn. Are they going to take a shot at you? No, they've got to move. Oh, dear. That snuck up on me. Move, move, move. Inside, inside. Now, go. Go. Do not be here anymore. Move. All right. They've got to come through there. This means hands... Where is Emily? Emily, 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 Emily. There you are. Let's get you up there. Hands. Want you down there. Bartok there. Armors here. Overlord. And dance a lot. Let's get into a position from which we can attack and then immediately draw back. Fire. Right, pull back. And back up. And pull back. Don't stand there because that Inferno can is not something I want to play with. Fire. Force them to keep having to reload. Right, Overlord, you're actually a little bit too close. Pull back. Okay, everyone take a shot. Well done. Pull back. All of you back one. Nice work. Wait for the reloads time to finish. It'll start moving and then I want you all back out. There we go. Actually, Overlord, you're not going back out. 
this is down to everyone else. Okay, Armus, back you go. That's a little bit too close now. There we go, and Hans, Bartok, you're up. Okay, that's it. I think that's the only chance we're going to get now. Actually, Hans can probably get another shot or two. Might be able to get Emily to sneak out behind them in a moment. Take the shot, Hans. Well done. Right, they're too close now. Bartok, Hans, you're going to be there for now. That's right, keep on coming through. It's going to be nasty once they get there, but... Emily, dance a lot. And Overlord, you're all up. Well done. Now I want you back again before that Infernal Launcher launches. And the moment you pop your head out there, I hope you're going to die horribly. There we go. Well done. Now that is going to be a pretty messy fight for us, honestly. Uh, it's not good. It is not good. On the plus side, we do have a lot of cannons, and they're very inaccurate with those miniguns. But those Infernal Launchers are going to be a problem. And they've managed to get an explosion inside the base. Oh, you scoundrels, you. Ah, oh, twice, and that one's full of wood. Okay, you know what? You are all free. I don't need my snipers at this point. I don't think they're going to be particularly useful. Rock Philip, get down there, put out that fire. Oh, okay, that one's reserved. Okay, hopefully all the fires are reserved by someone at this point. Right, I want you to all pop your head out, ready to attack. Now hopefully our cannons are going to continue to draw their attention. That's great, you set yourself on fire there. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. I'm not entirely happy about having Armus there. I prefer Armus to move across. Got a bit of a better lineup there. Overlord, you can go out and then down. That's right. We've lost a couple of our weapons so far. But on the whole, I think we're actually winning this one. And those fires are going to be murderous to them. They're not immune to flames. Oh, Jiggly God, why? No, bad. Get out of there right now. So Saturn, why? No, bad. Go. Ah, you're all so derpy. Don't want you there, because it is death. We just want the Infernal Launcher dead, and then we can rebuild everything else. I think that's it. Really? Wow. Oh, wow. Yes. Okay, everyone go put out fires, repair things. Oh, no, they're not dead. Bad times are these. Get back. Get back right now. Oh, my goodness. Are you alive? You are. Oh, my lord. Quickly rescue this is terribly bad pull back please pull right back all the way up there you all the way up there as well go no ah sod it rescue jiggly god and get out of there will you please stop stop being such idiots i mean seriously now this is just dumb There's levels of derpitude that I can suffer, and this is far too high. I'm going to let you go somewhere else, it's fine. We've lost a lot of stuff because of that. Okay, come on. I think... No, it's still one alive. Bloody hell. Might actually hurt it. Have we done it? Are they all shut down? I think they may all be shut down. Oh my lord. That was, that was bad. That was actually really bad. And all because I didn't wait to check. My fault. 100% my fault, that one. Right, let's get these walls replaced then. On there, there. And we want some walls there as well. Oh, that could have gone a bit better. Alright, let's uh, shut off that system. I want all of the centipedes slain. Uh, Rock Philip, you're actually getting that sorted. Fair enough. Right, want you. Add Bill, shut down. Add Bill, shut down. 
a bell shut down. Let's see how many of them it takes before we stop seeing the exclamation marks. There should be another one in here, actually. I bell shut down. I think that's all of them. Really? Everyone's rushing around trying to... Ooh, right, I need you to be undrafted. Go about, do your things. Go rest, be healed, whatever it is you need to do. Please do it quickly. Before these things repair themselves, because I think they can, unfortunately. Starvation. Oh, Hans is starving. With the amount of food we've got, and Hans is starving. That's just crazy talk. There we go. Thank you. And hopefully the last one shut down as well. Okay. Oh, I feel a little bit better now. A little bit, little bit uh, happier. We're going to need a new gun there, though. And... Wait, 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 wait. I have put these in the wrong place, have I? Um, possibly no. Okay. Actually, yeah, I, th I think I did put them in the wrong place. Uh, drat. Oh well. They're going to stay in the wrong place then. Because that is too convenient. I'll get the other light installed again. Right, well, hopefully we can uh, break them all down fairly quickly. We also want these ones as well, of course. All things told, that could have gone a lot worse. How's your health? Eh, you're okay. Your seventh rib has been shattered. I think we've got the adrenal rib now, though. Do we have the adrenal rib? No, we do not. That's interesting. Let's have a look. No, we're still waiting on that. How about you? Your torso's got a bit of a scar. Who else needs things? You've got a bad back, so you kind of need the spine. I need that nose installed for you. But it's going to be a while before we've got it. And you're doing all right. Got a bad scar on your torso, but that's fine. And let's have a look. No, we seem to be okay. Oh, you need a, a new prosthetic leg, actually. Do we have... Got a simple prosthetic leg. We actually want one of those bionic legs for you. Okay. That's not too bad. I could have been significantly worse. We can easily repair from all of that without any trouble at all, actually. Okay. Jiggly God has been fully healed. Hurrah! Let's go ahead and build up these rooms. We're not going to um, put the furniture in them yet. That'll come later. I want to get everything else sorted first. But that is right in the middle there and I can't get to it to repair it. A uh, bit of a shame. It'll be fine though. Okay, hopefully the bodies get moved over there. Um, we actually got one, two, three, four... Five, six, seven. Oh my goodness, we've got a lot of bodies that we need to sort out. So I'm just going to add 25 corpses. Go. Then I'll take that away once it's ready. Now, in here, we are going to want some proper flooring again. Well, let's have a look. What have we got in under more floors? I actually feel that this one should have the kind of cargo area this one. I, th I think that, that will fit in quite well. We definitely want to uh, seal this door fairly well against the heat traveling through it. So I'm going to use a regular granite block door for this one. Cargo pods. Let's have a look. Meat. Oh, great. Because we really needed that. So badly. Our meat is literally what's keeping us from not dying. Right now, we were on the verge of starving. Meat was 100% what we needed to keep this colony from descending into madness and cannibalism. Right. Let's have a look if we can get this set up. As requested. And then we'll put an A there. So that's A-V. 
There we go. Well done, let's get those bodies out of the way. Is this set up? Have we got someone working on this? I really hope so. Not yet, apparently. Wilda, can you do that? No, you're not a crafter. Oh, well, we'll, we'll, we'll wait on other people getting uh, everything sorted. There's loads of work to be done, so... I'll just wait for that to be uh, prepared for now. We've got one good gun there. A mad animal. I really don't care. Hands, you're actually not equipped. So, why don't you go and grab that, actually? Who else has not got a weapon? Because I'm fairly certain that one or two people did go down and drop their weapon. Jiggly God. Go equip the sniper rifle, please. And that is it. Not too bad. Where is that crazy squirrel? There it is. Benoit, please kill crazy squirrel. Okay, good, thank you. So much metal parts in there. We need to bring those in pretty soon, actually. How's everything going over here? Not too bad. Need to remove this, though. And then we can have the power going all the way around. There we are. Perfect. Oh, we're going to need to put in the vent work as well. There and there. Just to make sure that when we do build the door, in fact, we can build the doors now. We're going to have to have something there, though. Hmm. What am I going to do with that, I wonder? I guess I could just put down some nice wooden floors in here. I'm not sure these people deserve it, though. In fact, I'm fairly certain they don't. Oh, well, we can just have these wooden floorboards, then. Fairly certain the smooth floors are actually a higher value, so I'm downgrading their rooms in a way. We'll go with the granite blocks. Bonk, bonk. There we go. And we're going to need a fair old bit of wood for this, so let's get out there and start chopping down some trees. There we are. That'll do. Okay, hopefully we are starting to get some more of pla the plasteel done. Though we've used up an awful lot of the steel, my goodness. Really, we're all the way through all of that? Down to 70 steel. Goodness, that, that was expensive. Putting all those guns back in. Alright, well, given that, then, we're going to need to get back out there and start mining again. I was hoping not to have to do this, because it takes my colonists away from the colony. And it's at times like that that a raid will pop up, and then all of a sudden you've got half your colony outside. Is that marble or is that plasteel? I think that might be plasteel. Ooh. Perfect. Poor mood. Quite a few poor moods, actually. That's not fun times. Let's just get these corpses out of the way, though. Then people will stop being so uh, down about it all, I imagine. Well, I mean, we've got a storage space you can actually take that over to, by the way. I wouldn't mind if you did it. Oh, here we go. Bionic leg being made. Fantastic. Right, that is going to go to... Who has got the peg leg? Someone's got a peg leg. That's a simple prosthetic leg. You? Who's got it? Was it you? Was it just a simple prosthetic leg? Because I'll give you a, an advanced one. Rather than have you walking around on a simple one. It might actually be you, yeah. Uh, nose shot off. Bionic eye, bionic foot. It's a skeleton. Seventh rib shattered. Uh, well, have we made the, adre the adrenal rib replacement? Yes, we have. 
And we've made the nose. Okay, well, Alexander, first and foremost, you're getting your left leg replaced. There you go. Then, Sir Saturn, you're getting a nose. And following that, where are you? Was it Overlord? Yes. Your seventh rib needs to be replaced as well. There we go. So, three people needing surgery at the moment. How's everything going up here? We got any art that I can move out of here? No, unfortunately. Oh well. We'll get more and more components moved up there, though. And once we've got a bit more... Really? A group of pirates this time! Scallywags. Are they going to immediately attack, or are they going to linger around? Yeah, they're immediately attacking. I forgot to check the uh, warning there. Okay, well, we've already replaced all of the weapon systems, so... That's fine for now. But... <laughs> I've just disabled a bunch of people. Oh, uh, no, really? Are you outside? Oh, thank goodness. Right. Okay, we'll cancel that for now. Right there. LMC, let's get you into position. We're, we're going to be doing this without Sir Saturn, unfortunately. But on the plus side, that does mean that we can get all of our snipers behind there. You know, there's, there's, there's uh, a good and a bad to everything, I suppose. Let's get you down here. Rilda, if you would please... Oh, Nexus is doing that one. So that means Nexus, you're the next one to move down here. Now, Rilda, go flick the switch. Um, Bartok down there as well. Protocol. Armus. And Zorb. I want you up here. Along with Fatic. There. Benoit. And finally, hands. Okay, hopefully we can get everyone into their correct positions. Well done, Rilda. You're now free to move up here. We'll see how this goes. Shouldn't be too bad. We've got a lot of people coming through here, but not... Ooh, you've got uh, grenades. Not liking that at all. Slow things down a little bit. Yeah, you're being scallywags, aren't you? You cowards! It's not like they can get through there easily. Which is interesting. Yeah, they're just going to hang around there and be annoying. Okay. Or are you going to start coming up here? No, they're not coming up this way. Very well. You're moving down. In here, please, and across. You're just going to have to have a firefight. An all-out firefight. Down there. Across there. Move. There we go. Hopefully, you can all take shots. There we go. Now, we should be able to just mess them up from here. We'll bring down... You three. Come on, fire. There we go. Are they all close combat? They don't look it. They are going to get through, unfortunately, which is quite frustrating, but there we are. Not too much I can do about it. Trickly guard. Oh, I know what I can do about it. Well there. Why don't you head down there, ready to meet them? And that would be a great idea. There we go. They're going to pop their head back out, it looks like, and then just get ultimately slaughtered. And the nice thing about this is they really have nowhere to go. They're going to have to run the gauntlet of all of my defenses. Amos, I want them dead. That's right. Kill. Kill. Shoot. Kill. Damn it. Amos, move. Well done. They really didn't do too well with that whole uh, trying to burrow through. That ended up meaning that we managed to kill all of them without any trouble at all. I approve enormously of this. All right, okay. 
Well, we've got a load of things that we need to repair, unfortunately. But, you know, with things have happened. No, that one doesn't go there. We need that. Then we need to make sure that's a metal tile. It already is good. And just pop down a granite door there. That should be fine. Okay, well, we've got one person who managed to get through this. I th oh, no, actually, we've got three. Okay, let's have a quick look. Caring, social, you're lazy, tricky, happy, and volatile. You're not going to be joining us. You're incapable of intellectual and artistic. That's fine. You're a cold lover, a psychopath, and abrasive. I can give you a silent jaw to fix that abrasive quality. Intellectual artist, careful shooter. You're a pessimist, and you're psychically hypersensitive. That's not so great, but a joy wire would help with that. Or just a drugged rib, honestly. The careful shooter trait is particularly nice. Shooting 15. You'd be another sniper. That said, though... I mean, I've got the... I might be able to get all of you. Bartok, rescue bar the barber. I want to quickly, then, set up the furniture over here. There we go. If we can get all of this done fast enough, then I'll rescue as many of them as I can. Now that done, we're going to need some lighting in here as well, otherwise it'll they'll get quite uh, upset about the darkness. Right, what leathers have we got? We've got boar skin. How much does this take? It takes a hundred. Damn it, we have run out of alternative leathers. I don't think you deserve the comfort of a seat made by people for people out of people. It should, no, I'm not going to give it to you. You can just sulk. You're not getting it. I refuse. Flat out refuse. All right, let's try and get all of these things done if we can. If we've got the wood for it, which I think, yes, we should do, then we might be able to get the rest of this ready for you. But if we can't, then I'm not going to really worry about it too much, I'll be honest. There we go. A bed. That's all we need there. So that's one more that can join us. And it will be you. Captain Jupiter. There we go. This actually kind of has a a weird rustic look to it now, with the with the purple lighting specifically. Gives it a very rustic quality. Oh, I should also probably say that this uh, should have a roof. Probably. Probably a nice thing to do there. Also down here as well. Uh, down there, can st well, you know what? I don't even particularly care if that's no roof. This, though, has to be no roof for obvious reasons, because it's got solar panels there. That might actually seal... Yeah, it has sealed all of that off. Okay. Right, Jupiter, I need you to receive treatment and have people chat to you and try to recruit you. Okay. Well, that's going to be the end of this episode. I think we've done fairly well for ourselves. I'll uh, set everything else up to be uh, reclaimed. Hopefully we got some nice items out of that. But we didn't lose too much to it. All we really lost was some um, bricks to replace the walls. And that's something we can easily, easily afford. We may have just uh, captured ourselves some more people as well, which would be fantastic. We do need that bed done. But if we can just get that finished, I'd be very happy. Someone please go finish that bloody bed. There we go. All right, so we've got a bunch more prisoners as well. This is the first time that I've uh, had this many prisoners at the same time. We're, we're, we're getting there. We're starting to actually capture people instead of just murdering them. I feel, I feel maybe, maybe this is the beginning of a new... Ah, oh, we've been getting rid of all those corpses. That is just so annoying. Oh, well. But uh, I feel this is maybe a new leaf for us. Maybe. Possibly. Probably not. But it, it's a remote possibility that we might be becoming nicer kind of folk. But we'll have to see in the future episodes whether this trend continues or not. But that is it for us for now. So until next time, do take care.